Hello. This video is a thank you to FordGojiBerries.com and their goji berry plant that they sold me uh, about a half a year ago. On their website they say that their goji berry plants will fruit the same year. Mine fruited in less than half a year and completely under indoor artificial lighting. So I want to show you my the secret of my bedroom. I'm actually growing goji berries indoors in my room here. This is a bird cage with some lights and stuff pointed in it. And here are the plants. They're completely strung around in the wiring of the bird cages. Made it really easy to prop up vines and branches. And we're in the early part of the flowering of these plants, so I only got about 10, 10 ripe goji berries so far. But they're ripening from about green to complete red and plump in about four days and I got a lot of green ones that are popping on the lower branches that are about as big as these berries were five days ago. So I have a successful goji grow also indoors. So I'm growing goji berries not only in the states and in the winter as well. So grow goji in the winter fresh. So. I think it'd be hilarious to get a permit to sell these things fresh at a farmer's market completely out of season and just mess with people's heads. And that is a unique thing that only I can get to do at this point because I don't know, I don't see anyone else on YouTube growing these indoors so I think it's really funny. Um, but yeah, I'm a, I'm a complete amateur gardener so this video, I, I think Mike Seiler and the rest of them at forgojiberries.com and I think they're in Colorado, I believe. So uh, thank you. And uh, if I can do it, you can do it. Because I've never grown anything else before, let alone indoors. This is my first plant of any type that I've grown. And also, I did, I did kill all but one of my plants at first. And the, the major reasons were having the lights too close and overwatering. So if you tried growing a plant that you bought from 4 and they died, it probably died from one of those two reasons. And um, so this video, I urge you to try again and it will definitely be worth it because I will have a consistent supply of fruit all the time <laughs> Be, uh, because I'm doing this. So big thanks to forgojiberries.com. This is for you. Thanks Mike Seiler for um, coaching me over the phone whenever I had a problem. Um, if you are a beginner and you're trying to grow these, you will run into the same beginner mistakes as anyone else. You, uh, you will dry out your plants. You will burn them. You'll definitely burn them. <laughs> I still burn them. <laughs> But uh, you will get uh, success eventually if you watch them and you are attentive at first because you always have to at first when they're, when they're young because they're sensitive and they will speak to you in very subtle ways. <laughs> and, um, and then, yeah, once you get it going, you can have a, a large garden full of them as I do. So this is my thank you video. Thanks, Mike. And I hope you enjoy this video and keep growing your own food. Thanks.